uh, Greg and Betty, you guys are wonderful friends. And I didn't really realize how much I cared about you guys until I got that phone call. And it really had a chance. I mean, I, I, I can't let go of it. You know, I, I've seen death uh, in my life, but I can't let go of uh, Greg's. And it made me really reflect on a lot of things about Greg. When I think of Greg, I think of Greg and Betty. And you guys are an example for my marriage. And I told you guys this before, is that one day I want to do what, what, what you and Greg did. Is one day, if I retire, <laughs> that we can do as much good as, as you guys have, have done in your life. But with Greg, there's, there's things that really stand out with Greg. And I, I think, as I say, I think everyone's going to be in agreement. And with Greg, he would do so much. And the one thing that really stood out he would never ask for anything in return. I never know of Greg of ever doing that. I mean, he would just give and give, and again, Betty by his side, they were, they were a working team. The other one is, is, is Greg, whether he's talking to a head of a corporation, or he's talking to a homeless person on the street, he would treat them exactly the same, and, and have the same set, and also have time. He always had time for everybody, you know? And all I know is this, uh, Greg is, uh, I'll tell you, he's always going to be in my heart. And uh, one day when I see him, the one thing I really want to tell him when I see him is that we kept bridging the gap alive. And Richard had touched on that. And bridging the gap, I'm not sure if everyone in the, in the room is familiar with it, uh, but this is something that uh, Greg and Betty started together. And it's an incredible, incredible ceremony of the Vietnamese community and the American community <coughs> that, that we do need to continue. Uh, and I think, uh, isn't the next one in September in Westminster? And I'm sure, uh, please keep in contact with Betty. I'm sure she will let information out about that. But uh, all I know is that one day when I see Greg, I don't want to say that we dropped the ball and we didn't do bridging the gap. Uh, but what I say, I'll tell you, Betty, both of you have, have had a great impact on my life as an example of how to live, uh, and not only be Christians, but live the Christian life. And it really means a lot to me. And, and like I said, uh, as, you know, as everyone said here, you have affected so many people. Both you and Greg have, it's a ripple effect that has, there's so many people affected that, that, that you don't even know. You know. But all I can say is God bless Greg and, and Betty and thank you very much.